Hey, hey, y'all. It's Michelle from Monkey's Creations. Come on in and say hey. I'm going to get you pulled up. Good morning, good morning. <laughs> What's up, y'all? So, happy 4th of July, everybody. I am going live today because I am going out of town Tuesday, and I will not be back until Saturday evening. Um, and Monkey's not here. And I know some of y'all don't have family or friends that you can go visit on the 4th of July. Um, so I thought I'd come in and just share a smile and have some fun. So that is why I'm going live. Hello, hello. Thank y'all for joining me. If you could float my boat, I'd appreciate it. Um, so this is the cat kit. It is available on my website, monkeyscreations.com. Um, so what you get, you get the large, or the, I'm sorry, you get the character board, you get the cat vinyl, you get your zip ties, and you get two rolls, so 200 yards of the black tool. Okay. Um, now the one thing I did find out last year when I made these is it is so much easier and this is the only board that I do paint um, do you have to know it just makes it easier um, so I did paint the board black and um, you can use black acrylic paint you can use black spray paint um, whatever you want to use um, because it does make it easier um, with the black tool happy 4th of July y'all um, so I did paint this one and I know I usually don't but I did <laughs> um, so all of that comes in the kit now I am going to be making a bow um, this does not come in your kit um, and on this one I am going to put some ears um, and these don't come in your kits either um, but I will show you a simple way to make them you want this kit? It's available, Colleen. It's on my website, monkeyscreations.com. So I'm going to bring y'all down so you can see this gorgeous kit. Hey, there's my son. Good morning, good morning, y'all. So what I have done is I've got most of them already made. I left two to... Um, make for y'all um let me plug in my glue gun so that it can get hot while we're working thank you for floating my boat i appreciate it so i am using my measure buddy if you don't have a measure buddy you can just cut out a 10 inch piece of cardboard to measure the tool so I am bringing my measure buddy out to the 10 inch mark. So I am doing 10 inch pieces and I'm going to show you what I mean by that. Let me move this out of the way. Hey, hey, hey. Thanks for the stars. I appreciate it. So I'm taking the tool. Oh, let me get my ears out of the way. With my measure buddy at 10 inches. So I'm just lining it up right here at the top. And I'm going to wrap it 10 times. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Thank you for floating my boat. Good morning, y'all. And I'm just going to snip it off. And then what I did is I just took it right off and I clipped them all together 
just like that. That way we can get all of our pieces done and then just come in and throw them on the board. Um, this cat is the vinyl from Unique in the Creek. Okay, so that easy. So while my table is somewhat clean, I'm going to show you. If you pull and you want to add ears to yours, you don't have to. If you want to add ears, I've got a big chunk of glue. Ears to yours, you don't have to. But if you want to, go to pull up on your computer, clip art cat ears. And you'll see all kinds of cat ears come up. So all I literally do, well, just imagine this is the computer screen. So all I do is take a piece of paper, put it up over my screen, and I outlined the ears. And then I cut them out. Okay. So I always do, anytime I do templates like this for petals or... Um, any kind of eyes, like my unicorn eyes, those kinds of things, I always do a template and I label it. Um, so right ear, left ear, I know this one's going to be the cat. Um, and I keep them because I can always reuse them and then I'll always have them. Okay, so these are going to be the ears. And I'll just glue one on top of the other, and then I'll show y'all what we're going to do after that. Okay? But while my table was clear, I wanted to tell y'all that. So, clip art cat ears. Okay? So, let's get those out of the way. Bring our cat back up. Now, this one's so easy. This would be a good project to do with the littles. Your kids, grandkids, anything like that. Because all you're going to do once you get all of your pieces out, you're literally just going to take your clip off, put them right in the zip tie, and zip it up. Hello, hello. Just like that. Okay. So I'll do all the ones on the outside. When we get to the inside, I will show how I did this part again. But we're going to rock and roll this one out, y'all. And this one's so cute. Okay, so we're putting one in every zip tie. Hello. Happy fourth, y'all. Let me just bring some up here. <laughs> what are y'all doing today? Are you barbecuing? Are you just chilling, watching TV all day? My first text did go out today, y'all. So if you signed up for my text notifications, everybody was notified that I was going live. And I will give you my number. Y'all, I forgot to... I wrote it down, but I forgot to bring it in. So if you want to text me, my text number is 1-281-502-2228. And you will be notified when I go live. I text you. I even sent somebody a happy birthday message. Go sign up here. What I'm going to do is 
I'm just going to take and run it to the outside of the board. So I'm going to go right in this hole and load it right through there. Hello. You had a nice visit with your son? Awesome. Probably swim and relax. It's going to be a full work weekend for me. Oh, thanks. Hubby does all the cooking? Wow. That's awesome. Now when we get to the end, I will cut all of these open, and then you'll be like, oh my god, he's so amazing. <laughs> and everybody that does place an order with me this weekend will get a special surprise for the 4th of July. In their box. This is tool that I'm using, and this is a kit on my website, so you can go grab it if you want. Your son has the main course and we bring the dishes. All right. Well, my son's watching. So what you bringing, Johnny? <laughs> yep, this would be a great spinner. Yeah, you could definitely make it with black loopy yarn. Um, to Canada is expensive. Most of my kips ship to Canada for 40 to $50. So it's not cheap. You're cleaning your craft room? Well, will you come to mine when you're done? <laughs> Hello from the UK. Did you get from Amazon? It's just I just pulled up red loopy yarn. is fun and it's so quick and easy to put together. All right. Let's cut these zip ties.
how's the frog they're getting fewer and fewer right before i came live i think i pulled out maybe six so less and less every day <laughs> but i did find a, a lot of non-living ones this time i didn't get out there quick enough It is going to be big, for sure. But it's a black cat, and it's Halloween, so it's got to be big, right? All right, I'll show you one more time. So we're going to do 10 inches. Now, I have the measure, buddy. You can just, you need a white cat. Ooh, that would be pretty, too. Meow. <laughs> Um, so 10 inches or you can cut out a piece of cardboard 10 inches long and then you get 200 yards of the black tool in the kit so we're going to wrap it 10 times so 10 inches 10 times so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and I just dropped it and then just slide it off clip it if you want um, but I've already got all of these done so I'm just going to slide it right into my zip tie. Just like that. And voila. So you will have a little bit of mesh, or I'm sorry, tool left over. So you'll have about that much left over from the kit. So let's get that out of our way. And let's get this kitty cat done, y'all. Let me get this out of the way. Don't need the scissors anymore. All right. Happy fourth, y'all. If you have black, I should have used black zip ties, but it, it won't matter. You won't see it anyway. But if you have black zip ties, that would work as well. Yay. Y'all, Deanna Davis did an amazing job on a flower yesterday. So y'all need to go watch it. It is amazing at Ranch House Wreaths and More. She did it live yesterday. Gorgeous. I do not sell the vinyl separately. Nope, it only comes in the kit. If you want the vinyl separately, you can get it from Unique in the Creek. I will get all of these kits packed up now shipping or the postal service does not run tomorrow so I will get them all on my front porch Tuesday morning before I head out of town so they will ship um, before I leave or they'll be on the porch to ship out oh this one's so easy this is six inch tool
Wasn't it gorgeous, Regina? Yep. After seeing that one, and I said once I got figured out the Dahlia, it was going to be a one and done. But now she's going to make me do the all black Dahlia that I really wanted to do, but didn't want to do. <laughs> No, I am flying. Y'all, I don't, if you don't know me, I don't like to drive. I actually really despise driving. <laughs> um, so I fly whenever I can. No, I'm not painting y'all's boards. <laughs> if y'all want them painted, y'all gonna have to paint them. I think this is really the only time I think that I've ever painted the board. But I remember struggling last year to get the board covered because it is all tool so I was like I'm just painting it this time you hate driving yeah I just I don't know I've never even you know when I was young I never liked driving This is Tool, Stacy. Tool, how are you doing, my friend? I've been thinking about you. Yep, you can spray paint them. Absolutely. must have miscounted somewhere. Nope, it fell out. I did count right this time. <laughs> That's unusual, right? <laughs> Hold on, I hit a button. There we go. Yay, Lynn! And did you paint where the vinyl goes? I did on the very inside of where the vinyl would hit. That way, just in case, no board would be showing. Um, but I use just regular acrylic paint. But you can use spray paint, whatever you have. All right. Get these cut off and y'all can see the magic. There go the dogs. Y'all, my house is, is, place, is a place where people actually just show up. And I never even know they're coming. Is anybody else's house like that? I know, Stacy. I'm so sorry. But I have been thinking about you. Yeah. 
It looks like a leopard. <laughs> Okay, we got them all. So I can get that out of my way. Get that over there. Let's get these all the way. Before I cut these, let's go ahead and make a bow. Now, y'all remember, tool and mesh do not like each other. So they will stick. So if you get any mesh next to your tool, just be very careful, okay? That's my warning for y'all. So I'm going to use this gorgeous ribbon. And we're going to make him a bow. Or her a bow. Because it's a girl. Y'all don't have to. Now, this ribbon does not come in your kit. So, if you don't want to make a bow, you definitely don't need to. But y'all know how I am about my bows. So, let's make, let's make a bow. Good morning. And I am just going to use all one color. Um, it's live on my end still. So three, and then we're going to go to two. Okay, this is probably going to be too big, <laughs> but I'm going for it. needs a brush. Well, wait, we ain't even done with him yet. <laughs> Just wait. Okay, and then we're just going to do one. Um, I just use regular acrylic paints, but you can use that or you can use um, any kind of Krylon spray paint. Just make sure that it sticks to plastic. There we go. 
and it went back live. Okay. Awesome, Tammy. And that's usually the bow that I use probably 99% of the time. Okay. So we'll We'll definitely pull up that a little bit more when we get to that point. So let's bring the cat back. Y'all ready? I get so excited when I get to do this. <laughs> it excites me. All right, so we're gonna start cutting these open so i'm literally just taking let me bring y'all up just a little bit taking the whole thing and just cut it so just run your fingers Oh no! I'm glad you saved them. Where do you get your really stiff ribbon? Every ribbon is different. I mean, usually your canvas, your um, royal, your... I rarely buy silk ribbon because it just doesn't... I don't like working with it. It doesn't say where I want it usually. Um, so if I can work with a can canvas or something like that, that's generally what I'll get. But y'all y'all know I'm about reading descriptions um, so if it's something I like I order it and then I realize you know if it's wrong and I'm like oh but it was so pretty you know sometimes you just gotta use it I <laughs> did if it's freezing y'all there's nothing I can do about it I apologize um, I'm just going to keep going and hope for the best. This is a fluffy kitty now. They were, oh, so sad. I don't know why people do that. Now, hopefully they were just lost and not dumped. But we will do a, a ribbon 101 in the VIP group soon, Virginia, and I'll, and we'll go over different types. I've been meaning to do it, but I get so excited about other projects that I'm just like, ah. You need my shirt? I'd send you this one, but it's got paint on it. <laughs> yep, I always use wired ribbon. 
Yeah, it's not showing it's freezing at all on my end, y'all. So, I don't know. Now, we'll get her tamed down here a little bit. But I just want to get all of these cut. And if you don't want to do it at 10 inches, do it at 8 and it won't be so big. You need spiders to finish your tub? Girl, you had a lot of gaps and cracks in that tub. <laughs> So I'm just going through and putting my fingers through it to make sure I have them all. Inevitably, I always miss one at least. But running your fingers through, you'll catch them, the loops. Um, tool for the lion. It may. Hmm. I don't see why it wouldn't. If you have a black door, the color white, would you use? You could. Alright, let's tame this bad boy. <laughs> oh, my fingers. Caught one. Oh, you made the honeymoon sweet. How funny. Oh, really, Annie? That's fun. <laughs> it does. So I'm just bringing it all to the outside. So we can see that gorgeous cat. Now we'll definitely need a trim. I do go through and, and trim up all the ends just so they're somewhat even. And if you want even the middle, you can make, do it at 8 inches instead of 10. All right. Let's get a bow added. I'm going to do the bow right down here, I think. If we can find our way through all this tool. Now that everything's black. <laughs> Uh, Donna, you'll have to watch the replay, girlfriend, but they're all zip-tied onto the board. There we go. Oh, 
load on y'all. There it is. Well, I'm not done with it, Susan. Give me a chance, good friend. Give me a chance. Too tight. You've had several over the years. One was as fluffy as Some of y'all just need to trust the process. Hold on. Got the wrong, grab the wrong. There we go. Hold on. Oh, got it. out of our way. Y'all, I love, love, love this ribbon. And it'll fall in just a little bit. Now, if you wanted to add the ears, so I told you in the begin or in the middle, I guess, if you go to clip art, cat ears, cat ears will pop up. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I cut that trace them off the computer, and I cut them out, and I always save my my templates I use these as templates that way I always have them so I cut them out of foam and then all we're gonna do is glue one right on top of the other make sure I'm that little piece there we go okay so we'll glue it Thanks for the stars, Nadia. Um, have you joined the private group? Um, there is a post pinned at the top of my page. Um, so you can click on that. And then once you have subscribed, um, you can go request to join our Facebook group. We'd love to have you. And then write on here what kind they are so you know exactly 
what to use for the next time. All right. And then all I do is take the ears and I literally just glue them to the tool it's just so you can kind of see them through it so just kind of lift it up now I'm not going to do that right now because I do need to trim some of these so I'm going to trim them before I add my ears so you can still see them through the tool so let's bring you up we do we have so much fun in that group so there you go y'all is that not stinking adorable light is catching her face so this is just a fun easy craft you can do with your kids you can sell them they sell like crazy I sold tons of them last year um, so just have fun with them and you don't have to add the ears or the bow whatever you want to do make it your own and just have fun that's the whole point of crafting isn't it have fun. Fun, fun, fun. I think I keep getting my loops mixed up there. There we go. All right. Any questions? When I take pictures, I'll get him all, her all cute. Thanks, y'all. So 10 inch, wrap 10 times, and if you want to go eight on the inside, you might like it a little bit better. So I may kind of trim the inside a little bit um, so that it's not as fluffy on the inside, but they are adorable. And yeah, she's huge. She is 32 from side to side, y'all, so 32 inches. All right. Well, if y'all don't have any questions, let me unplug that glue gun before I forget. They have nine cats. Oh my gosh. Hey, hey, good friend. That's all right, Georgie. I just kind of popped in. So if you want to be notified, let me give you my number one more time. Now, just remember, this is an automated number, and I um, do not reply to those. And somebody's already tried to handle business on it. So the app, the text app, is not for me personally to run business. Um, you need to email me at uh, monkeyscreations100 at yahoo.com. But if you want notified on when I go live, my number is one. 281-502-2228. So you can text me and you'll get the notifications. I don't have time to relax, y'all. With Monkey not here and uh, me leaving um, Tuesday, this weekend was all about work for me. So I'll relax come Tuesday when I get on that airplane. <laughs> all right, y'all have 
did I see correctly back in the beginning when you measured the tool? You did 10. I did do 10 full rotations at 10 inches. Yes. But if you don't have a measure buddy, just get you a 10 inch piece of cardboard. It's just as easy, y'all. All right. Y'all have a great day. I hope you have an empty credit card. <laughs> Y'all, I don't, I don't use credit cards. So, and I have, we have been debt free for 10 plus years and don't use credit cards. And so we love that lifestyle. So y'all have a great day and I, I'll see y'all before I leave. Um, you may see me pop in tomorrow. We'll see, but sign up for the text notifications. That way, you know, bye y'all have a great fourth y'all.